These weeks keep flying by, but I don't think anybody's complaining. Mrs. G and I certainly are not. It's no. time for another weekend, and here to get us ready is, like I said, Mrs. Grant. I am so excited that it's <laughs> Friday. I can't even begin to tell you. We were just <laughs> talking about how crazy of a day just today has been. Yes. And then the rest of the week, not even to mention, right? Yes, exactly. <laughs> it's just been... But you know what? That's great. Tomorrow's Saturday. Yes. U of A is in town for a home game, and that is great because we don't have many of those this season. So if you're going to get out and go see them in the new stadium and see the new coach and just, you know, get to experience the new food, and now they offer beer and wine. Ooh. It's pretty nice. Tomorrow's the night. Tomorrow's but the night. All kicks off today. Yes, it does with Bear Down Friday, and it, we love this. It's a great pep rally. They used to do it right on uh, University Boulevard, but mm -hmm. now they've moved it off onto Tyndall right there at the corner that's where you'll find the stage because they're trying to stay out of the way of the streetcar that makes sense let's keep everybody out of the street and be running. safe so that we can just cheer on the wildcats you can meet wilbur and wilma kids maybe get a picture with them and our sister radio stations are all going to be there so it'll be fun well and there's so much to do along that road obviously yeah. even just off if you go into university you can get all sorts of food you can enjoy the the big ambiance there, getting ready for the game it's a fun time all in preparation again for that game tomorrow night yes. which for sumlin he's kind of had a tough go of it for the past yeah. few games no let's see if he can pull it out and the team can pull it out tomorrow right well you got to be there you got to be you know but in the seats and with your red on and be there to cheer them on kickoff is at eight o'clock tickets start at just thirteen dollars wow. for you to get into this amazing stadium and just you know bear down arizona get in there and show them your pride in this great team that we have super reasonable and i mean there's no such thing as a bad seat in no. that stadium they have that giant screen now where you can watch all the action anyway they have a couple different areas too i heard where you can just sort of stand at a sort of a balcony area yeah. and watch the game right really from up close i think that's what they have anyway yeah, they don't do. take my word for it but look look it up and go <laughs> Go check it out if you can. So go support the Wildcats. Also uh, support uh, ending hunger in our community, too, with yes. this next one. The Community Food Bank has something they call the Hunger Walk. And what I love about this is the 1.5-mile trek that they take actually takes you kind of in a little behind the scenes to their um, garden. It also takes you through their warehouse and everything yeah. to really see firsthand what they're doing at the Community Food Bank. But it's fun for the entire family. They'll have music and entertainment. They'll do healthy snacks and games and activities for all ages. This starts tomorrow morning at 8 a.m. at Sam Lena Park. Mm -hmm. That is at Kino Sports Complex. And if you want to get some more information about that, go to communityfoodbank.org. Well, get up early because that way the Saturday lasts a lot longer. If yes, you get up early, stretch get, it all that's out. That's right. Get the calories burned out of the way because <laughs> in the evening you're going to want to go enjoy some beer. Born and brewed yeah. beer battle. <laughs> yes, I please. said, what? <laughs> <laughs> it's going on at the Hotel Congress tomorrow night from 7 to 10. So it's a bunch of local breweries that are going to compete. And people are going to, we've got professional judges who are going to be judging them. But also there's a people's choice for best beer. So if you go down, you can enjoy the live music and the food, taste the beer, and then vote for the people's choice award. It's $35 admission and obviously a 21 and over event. Professional judges? How do I sign up for that job? <laughs> that you got to, I'm telling you, you got to be on <laughs> some sort of committee. You need to figure it out because. I'd, I'd end up having too many by the end of it. They all taste delicious. It's fine. And this is I'll why you can't. That. That's why judge. I'm not a professional. You were judge. just asking the question. You answered it That's, all by yourself. I do that sometimes. <laughs> this next one, you have to sing it for me. Come to, to my, my window. window. There we go. We have and to you know it. what? If you want to hear effort. the actual person who belongs singing that song, you can right here in Tucson. We're talking about Melissa Etheridge. She is performing at the Fox Theater Sunday night. Um, Meredith and I were talking about this on the radio this morning. She said, wait a minute. I thought it was somebody who was singing her songs like a tribute. I said, oh no. It's a real deal. She is here. Tickets start at $39. And if that's not necessarily your style of music, which I don't know why it wouldn't be, it's everybody's, but cool in the gang also. Tonight. Diamond, tonight. I'm so excited about this. I, For some reason, it snuck up on me. I remember when they first announced that they were coming, and I yeah. was like, oh, yeah, that'll be a rockin' <laughs> concert. And it's a Friday night, and now it's here. So I'm telling you that <laughs> if you want to go, 
It's eight o'clock at Casino Del Sol. This is their location at I-19 and Pima Desert Mine. Diamond. Or excuse Desert me, Diamond. I'm yep. sorry. Desert Diamond Casino at I-19 and Pima Mine Road. Tickets start at $35. There you go. Go out there, have a great time, <laughs> enjoy the music. There's so much going on. Tucson always brings it in, and we're getting into that time of year too, where it's going to start getting busier and busier and busier, yeah. isn't it? And the mornings and the evenings are the the cool times to be outside. So exactly football right. games, concerts outdoors, that kind of thing. It's the perfect time. Enjoy your weekend. Happy you Friday. Too. We I'm ready. <laughs> <laughs> now be sure to listen to 94.9 Mix FM every weekday morning to catch Greg and Mrs. Grant on the Morning Mix. Stream at any time at mixfm.com. And as always, we will be glad to mention your event next Friday. Send a message to our Facebook page with all of the details.